Hello. We are now at the second day of our observing of Venus from here, on the top of Mauna Kea. Uh, at the moment it is uh, 8.39 in the morning. We are uh, so uh, finalizing the preparation for this uh, fiber optics spectrograph connected to the uh, uh, underground instrument to the uh, Cassegrain bonnet uh, through a fiber which is attached to the bottom of the telescope you can see here in the background. And soon uh, the door will open, and we'll be able to uh, uh, look at uh, Venus through uh, this uh, shutter, which is currently under maintenance uh, in the uh, early morning hours of the workday here in Hawaii. Um, the observing run will last uh, for a total of five days, and uh, uh, we can observe Venus uh, when it is uh, sufficiently high in the atmosphere, uh, in the above the horizon, of course, and. Uh, um, so at the moment we are, we are preparing uh, the telescope uh, and uh, the spectrograph, uh, checking for the pointing sequences and uh, we'll soon be opening the dome doors. And uh, I hope this uh, gives you a sense of what we are doing here. And uh, this is an important step of uh, Venus observations to, get be able to be able to acquire those uh, dynamical data and also in other telescopes uh, the uh, chemical data uh, on the atmosphere of Venus uh, using those large ground-based instruments. Uh, from the top of Mauna Kea uh, volcano uh, in uh, Hawaii, uh, this is a Thomas Wiedemann of the uh, Eurovenus Consortium.